can you see my inside ring? Because these two can even then dart in off a little bit. So I want you to think a little bit about even here, like that you can ask him to be a little bit, I would be like a little, okay, 10 meter figure eight, right? But it's like, ooh, but he's only six, right? But it's like, what's that? You're gonna, but if you're gonna like threaten to do whatever, you're totally out of control. I'm gonna put you in a small circle, right? Which is a lot less bad than like twirling around and roll calls around this tiny circle. Does that make sense? But like that is exactly why we disengage the high names with the roll halter is to get this feeling that I can bend and kneel it, right? And so you're gonna think yeah, about how that roll halter then right. And make make it legit. Like if you have a roll halter, that's not. 30 meters long, right? That's like 12 meters long. So you do the same thing, right? Otherwise, it's too vastly different. So when you get on it, you've got his attention in the road culture, but then when you get on it, it's totally in the game. Is that again? So I would like half, and I don't care if you make it like V to L and just right back and forth. I don't care if I'm in the center of one of the circles, but 10 meter figure eight. Again, he's not obedient, and he's forgetting he's being ridden right now. And so you have to be like, hello, I am, right, me. If he was doing that shit on the rope halter, you would like get in his face and be like, me. Pay attention to me. Me, not me. And then you're going to repeat it as many times as possible. 10 meter circle, that's too big, right? 10 meter, 10 meter. 10 meter, 10 meter. Because you've got to relax his back. You've got to be able to put your leg on, and you've got to be able to get his neck down. Good girl. Good job. Good. Walking forward. Not a girl. Good. Walking forward. Walking forward. You're going to be, you're going to feel also too, and that I can put my leg and my rein on you, and you're like receiving that information. Good girl. Good. Sit up and sit back. Left leg not too far back. Turn, turn, turn. I moved already to get out of your line. And you're following me. <laughs> you're like, here I come. Yeah, good. Good. Walk forward. And he is not allowed because he's big enough at the door, right? So he's not allowed to turn your forward anymore. He's got to pay attention to you. Good. Right forward. Right forward. Not even to the word part, right? Whereas if you saw him on it, he's just you. Yeah, he just did the three things that are like, you know, a little nerve wracking. Right? Yes. Walking forward. Walking forward. Walking forward. Walking forward. Atta girl. Well done. And we're not going to be mean, but we're going to be clear. Right? And you've got to take charge because he's nervous about his environment. You've got to really show up, right? Because he's like, oh, I can only come 20 because there's horses outside the door and the parking lot looks different or it's raining or it's windy or whatever. You gotta be like, okay, well, if you can only come 20, I gotta come 80. And then you gotta find out, like, what does my 80 look like? Yeah. Yes. Good. Walking forward. Walking forward. Walking forward. Just a bit. Not a girl. And because you feel he's, like, pulled back, right? He's, like, the girl is too tight. That's why I'm picking these tiny crystals. Does that make sense? Written just exactly the same thing. If he was to explode and jump around the little halter, you would yield them right, you would yield them left, you'd change direction, you'd ask him questions, you'd disengage the high legs, you'd make them bend, you'd take them back up, or they can pay attention. So you've got to connect that to this, because that's exactly the same. I own five of those, right? Like, all of us going to a halter. Good job. Good job. Yes, ma'am. Forward, forward, yeah, exactly. Being super clear what you want them to do. Good. We'll just go forward on the bit, I'll try to counter like an Indian little soldier. And he's like, ah, I'm getting good at today. And it's like, exactly, take it to the top. Nope, not like that. Does that make sense? B, C, P, here is that. And he's, he's bulging and staring out the right. The small circle to the left. Small circle to the left, bend and left. Not a girl. Good. Good. Right hand out. Good job. So it's always a good horse, and it's always a sweet horse. But that was not good or sweet, was it? Right? I always tell my husband, now, this is not naughty. He's like, you're back to 
Good. Elbows close, hands close. Good. We're going to repeat the leg yield one more time. Good. Elbows close, hands narrow, everything, everything, because he's a narrow guy, you know what I mean? I mean, he's a little round in his belly at the moment, right? But his leg, his shape is narrow. Good. And his balance is narrow. That's why he's a little tippy. Good job. Well done. Good. If you want to take a walk break, now would be a fine time. Or we change direction, do the same thing to the right. Good job. Nobody's allowed to act a fool. Nobody's allowed to act a fool. <laughs> Get yourself a little job in the sweatshop for that. <laughs> Just He's so cute. I know it's hard to not get, it's, it's hard to, you know, be mad at him. But that behavior, he, that, that needs to go away. And it's not like we just need to stop doing that, right? But it's like, I need to have a plan in place that now I know he can get like that. So I know he never does this at home, right? And he's never like this, except when. You know, but I need to train him in those moments that except when the train goes by at lamplight, you know what I mean? That's really hard to, that's really hard to train for. But uh, he needs to be more honest off your leg and, tr and trust you more. Because he was a little bit like, every man for himself, you know? And you're going to be like, no, it's not every man for himself. <laughs> and then you have to have like a plan in place of like, what questions do I have to ask him on the ground of my real palter, right? And, and get in there. If he's, if you get on him and he's acting like that, you didn't get to the bottom of it in the real palter either. Does that make sense? And I know it was a little bit like all the shit didn't kind of happen until you got on, yeah. right? But it's like you got to have them like so good and so tuned in and know that something is going to get like this if something goes on, that you're going to be like, i got to make sure 110% you are really with me because sometimes you hold out on me and I get on you and one thing happens and all of a sudden you disappear for eight minutes. Good job. Good job. Super job. Good. Short and range, back to trot. And I want you to think about getting a bit more narrow. So you get the nap for me means you gotta get a little closer to him. Right? Because he's a little bit like, he's like this long piece of paper, right? And he's like, I'm just kind of a tippy, tippy canoe, you know? And you're gonna be like, knees, elbows, hands, seat bones, close to him. To give him security. Because what that behavior was was insecurity. And then when the horse feels insecure, we have to fight that feeling in ourselves that we also get insecure. We have to be like, well, shit. You know, I won't, he's at 30 now because something happened. I gotta come 70 and be like, you're fine. No, you're fine. And the conversation of telling him he's fine, we gotta just figure that out, right? 10 meter circles have never let me know. You know, and then I, and I have a four year old who's trying to dump my kids in Germany right now, you know? And he doesn't anymore, but when we got him, he was tough. And uh, of course, it was food for me by the door, but with the girls, it's pretty special. And then he could feel the one was getting kind of scared, so then it got a little worse, and I'm like, okay, we've got to stop this, right? But it's like, uh, I'm like, I don't want to do 10 meter circles on my four year old, right? But it's like, well, if it's between you or me, I'm picking me, you know? And screw your legs and screw the 10 meter circle. You better listen to the mom. Good job. Take that back to chop. Good job. Good. Straight into your left brain. He's not paying attention. Good. Yeah. And so when I, outside rain, outside rain, change your pulse into you know? Good girl. Good. Outside leg and rain. Outside knee and rain. 
Now I'm going to try the old cough tactic. Good girl. And you just keep writing what you want, not what he's giving you. Good. Straighten through the left brain. Good. So your right brain doesn't touch his neck. And your left brain, he's got his neck bulged against your left brain. Does that make sense? So you got it with your left leg and your left brain and your left knee. You've got to send his neck back to the right brain. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Okay. Down the center line and leg go. Outside in. Turn him with his left shoulder, left shoulder, left shoulder, left shoulder. Good for you. Leg go. Good job. Excellent. I mean, he's so freaking cute. But, you, you know, you can only go on cuteness for so long. And then you got to get a job. And you have to show up for work, dress up, and do the stuff. Good job. Good, straighter through your left brain. There you go. There you go. Wonderful. Center line, leg yield again. Thinking about your outside aids, outside aids, outside aids, outside aids. Good. And leg yield. Good job. Yep. I love it. Keep going. Oopsie. A little more hind leg. Yeah. Good. But be careful that your right brain doesn't get too involved. Because he is begging you to pull on his little right brain. And that means your left leg and your left brain and your left knee have a bigger job. Good. Good. Outside aid. Outside green finger. Yes. And over you go. Keep it the same. 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 Like an army sergeant. Oopsie. Oh, when I stop saying the same, he stopped doing it. <laughs> yeah, so you got to keep it at, to the end, exactly the same. Right? That's you being the boss. Good. One more time. Good. you got to keep it the same to the wall till it's over. You can't quit riding. Good. The same, the same, the same, the same. Step over 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 step over. Well done. Walk and pet. Very good. It's not like we're not going to be nice to him when he does the stuff. But you've got to get a little more straight line thinking to be like, can you hear me okay? Can you hear me? Maybe we turn it off, actually, don't we? How about that? That's true. You were leg yielding so good, you flipped this switch right off. You need one, oh, another battery?
Lisa. the 
canister. Well done. Good. Down the quarter line and leg you to the track. Left hand low. Why? Because he gets crooked with his cute little face and he wants to keep his nostrils to the right. Good job. Over you go. Yep, over you go. Good. Repeat. Quarter line again. Because that has to get a little bit easier, so we have to practice. Good. Left hand down. Over, over, over you go. Over, over, over you go. Much better. Super. Back to the trot. Good. Stay close, 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 close. Organize. Leadership. Steady, steady, steady. Well done, Lisa. Beautiful. Beautiful there. Walking a little break. Great job. He's a lot better. That's way better. sleep last night. Yeah, because Lucy was messing with her. Having to tell her some stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and she wouldn't stop until she listened. <laughs> Good girl. Exactly. Okay. Back to contact. And back to drop. Yes, yes, yes. Good. Now you're going to allow the 
to change and bend, but I don't want him to leave the circle, right? So this is that coordination of your left foot against your right knee. Yes, because it's his body that needs to change, which that means he's got to be between your eight. Awesome. And leg yield out. Good. Elbows in. Speed evasion, are you surprised? Nope. Good. Hands low and together, right? Get yourself organized. Neat and tight, neat and tight, which means elbows are part of your body. Hands are low by the wither. Legs are close. Your plan is clear. He cannot talk you out of it, as cute as he may be. Good. Rhythm, 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 rhythm. You are contacted to my fit, right? Look up and read the Brigham German up there. Yeah, rhythm, 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 rhythm. Good. You listen to me. Yes. And he's going to have a lot of white noise and a lot of like little moments of Tourette's. And you just like <laughs> keep your eye on the prize. And you're like, we are trotting this rhythm. Rhythm, rhythm, rhythm. I boss you, not the other way around. Yes. Into the left leg canter when you're ready. Steady hands. Good. Good. Sit the canter. Sit the canter. Short ten your right. Good job. Elbow what's your right arm doing? Oh my God. Good, that a girl, narrow in. Doesn't matter, keep trying, keep trying. Right, when he breaks to trot and he's above the bit of running, don't canter that, right? Get it back on, because what do you teach him? Oh, you should canter above the bit and out of balance, right? Take your time, change your back, change your posing that again. Good, rhythm, elbows close. Good, organize, right? He's like in first grade, you gotta be the first grade teacher. Yes. Good, which means lots of clarity, lots of consistency. Well done, push it through. Good, good, shorten your ramp. Keep your elbows, keep your seat, keep the canter, rhythm, rhythm, sit the canter, sit the canter, gallop, 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 gallop. Sit the canter, sit the canter. Well done. Go oh, bending, bending. He doesn't want to do it. Good. Right over the top of his problem. Good, good, good. I hope your right thigh is back because that's the canter position. Well done. Well done. Back to the TR routine. But organize. Balance. Elbows, hands, elbows, hands, elbows, hands. Oh, don't, don't kick him. Don't hit him with the whip when he's listening. Right? You're organizing your body and he's listening and you just hit him with the whip because he got he gave you feedback on it. Good. Maybe your adjustment was too loud and he over listened. Can't hit him for listening. Good, on the bit. Yeah, when you're ready. Hands down. Organize. Neat and tidy. Back to the canter. Because we gotta get into that plie. On the bit, on the bit, on the bit, on the bit. Doesn't matter. Yeah, keep the canter, keep the canter, good. But your right leg is in a trot position, right? So you've got to read your mind and not your body. Yeah, get your right thigh back, down the quarter line, and plie. Right leg back, right leg back, right leg back. Or he doesn't know he wanted to keep cantering. Good, fine, good. And the right leg's back, good job, repeat. Right leg's back doesn't mean it has to be driving. And it doesn't mean it needs to be on, but it needs to be in the positional information where when this thigh goes back, that means bend. When you are going left and you bend, you're cantering. So your legs have to be in a bending position, or he will drop. And then your right leg needs to be hit with the stick, not him. Good job. Awesome job. I love it. I love it. Excellent. Well done. One more time. Keep your eye on the prize. What do I want? What do I want? Yes. Super job. Yeah. Wonderful. 
Going really so good. Back to trot. Balance. Organize. Awesome. Balance. 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 Rhythm. Rhythm. You are the boss with your leadership. Yeah. I'll say brain. Steady. Steady. Super. Walk. 